Hello church family, Pastor Craig coming to you today from, well, the garbage dump of all places. As we're going through these continuing series of uh, small sermons and just keeping you in touch and fellowship and God's word, I got to thinking about garbage today. Yeah, I know, my mind goes to weird places. You should be used to that by now. But what is garbage? You know, we think about the things that we throw out because they're no longer valuable to us. They don't have any worth or any merit or we just used them up or... Uh, just they're not important to us anymore, to the point that they are worth just throwing away, just garbage. What's tragic is sometimes people get to a point in their life where as they evaluate their own self-worth or value, they start thinking of themselves as garbage. And that's really sad. And it's totally untrue, especially when we consider what God has to say about who you are. First of all, consider this, and God created us. God created mankind, man and woman. Uh, amongst all that God created, only mankind did God create in his image. And only mankind did he breathe the breath of life into. That that's, that's makes us very unique and sets us apart from everything else that God created and helps establish that relationship that we have with him. Everything that God created, you, you and I, we're unique. Mankind is, is unique in his eyes. And we look about the way that God created us too. We read that God is love. And so I want you to think about something that you may have created over your lifetime. Uh, something that you didn't really care about and just kind of threw it together and kind of went together or didn't really quality control wasn't a big thing you really weren't invested in it all that much but when we love something we take the time to be intentional and to make it the way that we want it to be made and that's the way that God deals with us God loves us we know this God's word is clear in this throughout so many scriptures God loves us so much that he sent his son to die on the cross for us to restore the relationship that we broke with him and so when God created us, he took his time and he made you fearfully and wonderfully in the womb exactly the way that he wanted to make you. I am exactly the person that God wanted me to be. And so are you. When you look in the mirror, I, I want you to consider that the person looking back at you is exactly the person that God created to be exactly you. And God loves you so much. Yeah, I want to read a scripture for us real quick if you... It's in Ephesians chapter 2, uh, verses uh, 4 through oh, about verse 10 or so. It says, But God, being rich in mercy, because of his great love with which he loved us, even when we were dead in our transgressions, made us alive together. With Christ, by grace you have been saved, and raised us up with him, and seated us with him in the heavenly places in Christ Jesus, so that in the ages to come, he might show us the surpassing riches of his grace and kindness toward us in Christ Jesus. For by grace you have been saved through faith. And it goes on, but I want you to understand uh, the, the point of all this is that sometimes we consider ourselves to be unworthy un, of, of life itself. It's just garbage. And it's not true. God loves us so very much. It's the exact opposite of what we do. We take things that have value and we turn them into garbage. God took us. Even when we are dead and having no value, and he turns us into treasure by his grace. His riches become ours through our faith. So have joy today. God doesn't make garbage. You're not garbage. You are loved by God.